back in, and right now we can do the um, polls because Hillary Clinton is cl continuing to brush off those early state poll numbers that show her locked in a tight race with Bernie Sanders in both Iowa and New Hampshire. Here she is in an interview released yesterday by the Des Moines Register's editorial board. Do you have concern about where you are three weeks out from the caucuses? I really don't because I always expected it would close. I, I never, you know, I don't really pay attention to polls um, because, you know, there's just no guarantee. We know that uh, uh, the circumstances of polling, the kinds of polling that is done, uh, the uh, difficulty that people have had in polling races. Most pollsters have had problems in the last uh, couple of go-arounds. And so I'm focused on what we're doing on the ground. I, I just feel good about where we are, but it's unpredictable. And, you know, we'll have to wait and see how, how it turns out uh, when the folks are actually in the room. Just, you know, Joe, I'll, I'll let you, I know we got Josh back, but it's just, yeah. uh, you don't look at polls, but all of a sudden she's attacking Bernie and showing a real differentiation between her and him like she never has before. Again, Yeah, whatever. I mean, listen, uh, she, she, she can't afford to lose Iowa and New Hampshire back to back. Yeah. Those polls are very close right now. We'll see what happens. People can talk about South Carolina and how things go. It sounds a lot like Rudy Giuliani's yeah. Florida strategy. Just you, you can't get embarrassed if you're the pr presumptive, if, if you're the massive presumed front runner a year out. You can't lose in Iowa and New Hampshire to a guy who's a socialist from uh, Burlington, Vermont. That would be a problem. Um, let's.